Hello everyone, I'm Extra Cheesy 87 and this is Let's Play Final Fantasy 7 Part 25. In the previous video, we arrived at the Temple of the Ancients and got to learn about Sephiroth's uh, master plan, wherein he was going to fuck the planet and nobody can stop him. We have to get the Black Materia. In order to get the Black Materia, we have to sacrifice one of our party members. Kate Sith has volunteered. Now, whether or not um, they will betray us at the end, we do not yet know. So, you said go back to the entrance. What do you, what do you mean by that? I'm guessing you want us to go up here to where the door was? Shit don't open? It's warm. This is not good. Oh. A cloud behind you. Okay. Maybe I should have healed up. Like, we're actually at max HP. We're just missing some MP. It's, uh... It's, a, it's an angry wall. I'm very afraid of the angry wall. You have healing wind, so pop that bad boy. That did nothing? Okay, so don't use fire. Got it. How much does this heal for? Not really enough. Oh yeah! Okay, not quite the 3,000 we were seeing earlier. Uh... Yeah, go ahead and cure Cloud. Give him the heals that he needs. And, I mean, we can maybe risk a sense. Go for the Lunatic Hots. Ooh! Go for the Lunatic Hots. Maybe a little aggressive. A little risky, I should say. Okay, you cure Aerith. So you have a lot of... So you're a real big boy boss. Unlike the fake joke. Don't do it. Don't do it. Okay. Um. Please heal yourself at least. Eric, have you thought about actually having more than one HP? Have you considered upgrading from having a hit point hit point to having multiple hit points? I think it is a an idea that would greatly benefit the crew. That straight up one shot a cloud, eh? Why is this guy so strong compared to everything else we've ever fought in? Or fought. We're in that classic RPG uh, position. Dude, he just does so much fucking damage. We're in that classic position where you can't res your party members because they keep using AoE attacks before you can even potentially heal them. I don't know, like... He literally hit us twice for 1,300 damage per time before we could even cast a heal. And save. Why is that fight so much more difficult than anything else in the game? Gotta go listen to Sephiroth talk again. It's it. I started the battle on like super fast mode by accident. Um... So we're off to a bad bad start here at the beginning. Is Aerith dead instantly? No, she's not dead yet. Um, uh, my screen just glitched out. This fight does suck. You can't convince me otherwise. We did unpause, right? Yeah. In my, in my panic, I was like trying to unpause the recording while also... Uh, Trying to turn the fast forward off. Nothing does damage to this fucker. Um, don't heal the enemy, please. Dude, what the fuck? He just did 2,600 damage. I'm like, I honestly like don't understand why this fight is so much more difficult than anything else in the game.
Like, he does so much damage. Yeah, we did get lucky with the cure going off at the exact right time. I mean, that's our last cure, so... Our last AoE cure. Okay, never mind. We actually still have two more? I don't know. Okay, so basically what we have to do is we can't ever attack with Nanaki. Nanaki just has to heal. The guy seems to resist all elemental damage anyway, so... But please attack someone? Like... Do something so I can react to it? Uh, that was a joke. Okay. I mean, your super attack wasn't really that intimidating. It was actually pretty much less damage than your normal attacks. Is the game, like, why does the game do that? I don't know if that's, like, what the... Like, why it blacks out your screen whenever you cast that, uh, use your window break. We've almost got him, I think. I mean, really, the main reason we lost back there was because I took the time to sense when I really, like, we couldn't afford to do that. I mean, that's actually, like, good. I'd much prefer him to be doing that attack than the... the whatever you call it. Where he does the the meteor, the rock, cave in, whatever it's called. That attack, I mean that attack is so much worse than anything else. Dude, how are you still alive? I don't think we can res him. I think that's another one of the problems is once someone dies, they're dead. You can't save them. I mean, as long as Cloud and a healer stays alive, we're fine. Well. You should almost be dead. I am still a little mad about him getting to do his super attack twice in a row before one heal went through last time. The little bullshit. Okay. Yeah, that fight's bad. Well, it's not very good. It's not awful, but it's, you know, not good either. Ah, here he is. Oh, the one you all been waiting for, Kate. Leave this to me. Well, everyone, take care of yourselves. Uh, Kate, your voice is different every time you talk. Shut up, lady! Come on, Cloud, you have to say something. Good riddance. I'm not good at this. Hmm, hi! Understand, I feel the same way. I know, why don't you read our fortunes? Alright, why not? Uh, haven't aided on that for a while, eh? I am so excited, right or wrong, it doesn't matter because that's what the key in Kate is all about. Ah, uh, what do you want to know? If you'll actually die or not. Hmm, let's see, how compatible Cloud and I are? Oh, I'm afraid that I cost you exactly one date. Uh, here I go. Zero percent. Oh. Oh, this is no good, can I say it? Poor Tifa. No, tell me. It'll be okay. Well, alright. Your stars are aligned. That's the perfect match, and hey, I promise you, you had a bright future together. Cloud, ha, ah, you'll be your MC and go between and spy, whatever you want. Ah, just call me when it all happens between the two of you. He's dancing. 
Ah, oh, thanks for believing me, knowing I was a spy. Ah, really mean that. Well, uh, here we go. Uh, see you later. Good luck, Kate. Ah, oh, she said good luck. That makes me feel kind of happy. Now, here's another question. Do we trust him to be able to solve the puzzles? What happened? He's dancing. Good. Looks like I'm not broken. Aye, hey, this must be it. You ain't just should have put some effort into this. Ah, I can protect the planet. Hey, hey, I am blushing. Oh, there's plenty of bodies like mine around, but there's only one of me, damn it. The name forget about me, even when the new Kate arrives. All right, let's do it. Then it's time to save the planet. Boy, howdy, sure would suck if Sephiroth was gonna show up at this exact moment and kick our ass. That would just be truly awful. That's the black materia. Oh, but go get a boy fetch. I'll have a little sit down. I don't see anything. As long as we have this, Sephiroth can't summon Meteor. Uh, can we summon Meteor? Asking for a friend? Cloud. Oh, could we use it? No, not right now. It needs great spiritual power. You mean a lot of spiritual energy? Yeah, that's right. The spiritual energy of one person alone isn't enough. Hmm, maybe in a special place you could... A place filled with the planet's energy. Of course! The Promised Land! But... Sephiroth's different. He's not an ancient. And you shouldn't be able to find the Promised Land. That's you're wrong, but I have. Far superior to any mere ancient, I have traveled the life stream acquiring the knowledge and wisdom of the ancients, and the knowledge and wisdom of the ages that followed. Now I will create the future. We won't let you, the future belongs to everyone. Haha, <laughs> I wonder. Wake up. Oh, is he the voice in our head the entire time? Sh shut up! Be quiet. There, Cloud. Such a good boy. Uh, what? Yeah, he's running. Slow motion. Oh, we can move. Uh, stop. Don't be scared of him. No. Don't don't be scared of him. Aerith, girly, help. No. Oh, don't be don't be scared. Don't be scared. Gave the black material to Sephiroth. No! Don't do that. Well done. I mean, couldn't he have just, you know, like whacked slap Cloud with his uh, sword instead of having a mind fucking? Cloud, you're right. Gave the black material to Sephiroth? What have I done? Tell me, Earth. Be strong, okay? Dude, Nanaki is hopping mad. What have I done? Cloud, you haven't done anything. It's not your fault. I'm... Whoa. Whoa, that's a little excessive. Cloud? Uh, looks like this is a bad time. 
I'm K number two, pleased to meet you. Hey, Earth, you alright? Everything's gone blank. What did I do? I don't remember a thing. My memories. Where do they begin? If all this has been a dream, then I don't want to wake up. Somebody's behind that tree. Hey, I... Are you there, Cloud? Yeah, Aerith, uh, sorry about before. I don't know what happened. It kind of like I was beating the shit out of you, but, uh... Don't worry about that, okay? It's just a little domestic balance between friends. I can't help it. Oh... What? Well then, uh, you worry away. Let me handle Sephiroth. Um... I have to doubt whether you can do that or not. Granny, she does have the ability to teleport now, so that seems pretty handy. And Cloud, you really ought to think about who you are. That way, you won't keep losing yourself, you know? Where are we? Shit, dude, I don't know. A forest which leads to the City of the Ancients. It's known as the Sleeping Forest. It's only a matter of time before Sephiroth summons a meteor. That's why I have to stop him. As the last of my people, I'm the only one who can. The secret to doing that lies just ahead. At least, it should. Yeah, I feel it. It's that though something is guiding me. Well, I have to dash. See you, see you when this is all over, okay? Aerith? Cloud, you're not moving. Oh my, she intends to meddle with our plans. She'll be a difficult one, don't you think? The real waifu Sephiroth has appeared? That girl must be dealt with soon. Like you were having a nightmare. How you feeling? Uh, I don't really know. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. No point worrying about it though. Um, Cloud, Aerith has disappeared. Everyone's out looking for her. City of the Ancients. That's where Aerith is heading. There might be a way to prevent Meteor. By herself? Why'd you go by herself? Okay, we're going to. Only an Ancient. Only Aerith can stop Meteor. What if something happens to her? If Sephiroth finds out, she'll be in trouble. Sephiroth already knows. So why are you still sitting there? Let's go, Cloud. No. Might lose it again. If Sephiroth is near me, I might... Yeah, it's your fault Sephiroth got his hands on the black material. It's time for you to man up. Well, I mean, once again, he could have just kicked our asses anyway. Man up? We all know you got problems. Hell, maybe you aren't even sure who you are anymore. But Cloud, there ain't no getting off of this train we're on. Came this far, aren't you going to settle things with Sephiroth? No. I'm scared. If this keeps up, I might lose myself altogether. I'm afraid. Goddamn hopeless, that's what you are. Think about it, how many people in this world really know themselves? Everyone worries when it's a problem they can't... Uh, what? Everyone worries when it's a problem they can't deal with or understand. But they go on living, they don't just hide away and you're no different. Well, I mean, plenty of people hide away, but... Cloud, you'll come with us, won't you? I still believe in you. What? what am I supposed to do? Just turn back? Turn back to where? Cloud. Hold on, Tifa. Give him some time. He has to decide this for himself. You said you believe in him, right? Am I afraid to know the truth? If so, why? Well, okay, apparently we've been here before. Where are we, sir? 
Back among the living, I see. Those people are so worried they stay by your side the whole time. You sure have good friends. Oh, we're back in uh, the village. Gong, gong, wherever it was. Cloud. Yo, how you feeling? There's just one thing I gotta know. Which is it gonna be? You wanna find out by yourself, or are you afraid to find out? Either way, if you stay around here, all you're gonna do is worry. Even if you go nuts next time we meet Sephiroth. Look, if it happens, it happens. Just have to smack you sil your silly spiky head till you come around. But it'll be alright. We're all with you. But, like I said, if it happens, it happens. Stop worrying. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Come on, let's go find Aerith. What are you? They're our party? Now, you, you guys are a little underleveled. But it should be fine. Maybe we're just overleveled, actually. That's possible. Yeah, Gongaga, that's it. Where Zack was from. The mysterious Zack. Has he made it home? Ever heard of a soldier called Zack? Guys, you guys are have a one-track mind. So, uh... You didn't really give me any hints on where the City of the Ancients might be. Other than that, it's in a forest forehead. Okay. Well, places we haven't gone. There's this dot further to the south than the ancient whatever, Temple of the Ancients. I don't know if we can get there with the tiny Bronco. Maybe we can maneuver our way in. I think that's one of the only dots we haven't gone to. Yeah, it doesn't look like you can get there. Yeah, because... Wait. Maybe? There's a... There's a hope. Possibly. No. Where, where are we even? That... Cause... I have no clue where we are. And we could land on those beaches. Okay, I see the dot. That's probably not the City of the Ancients, I would hazard a guess, but I don't know how to get over there. Oh, you guys have no materia. Can I at least put Nanaki back in the party? Like, where, where is everybody else, by the way? Yeah, at the very least, get Nanaki back in here. Um... Yuffie's the only character we haven't really used. We could give her a trial period while Aerith is gone. And don't we have, like, a good weapon for you? Yeah, the Fuma Shuriken. Halves fire, ice, and lightning damage. And then just, like, good, good defense. I'm not going to give you that. You can take this. You can take the... I mean, honestly, is two defense worth it? I mean, is it? I mean, it doesn't really seem to be that much better. You lose all your magic defense. Now, the slots do look different. It has growth of none. Why is this thing just pure garbage? Okay. Go ahead and tell you now, I ain't, I ain't using that shit. Fire ring. Here, you can have that. You can have the fire ring for now. Um, I guess here's what we'll do. We will pause while I put material on everyone and then um, also try and figure out where, where we're supposed to go. So, be right back. Alright, so after the long and arduous journey, we're back in Bone Village, which is apparently, uh, it's on the same continent as the Sleeping Thing. We need a Lunar Harp, according to the lady up there, and this dude can get us a Lunar Harp. 
Uh, can I buy something? Sell anything good? Nope. Okay, cool. Nice talking to you. Yeah, uh, please start digging. I want a lunar heart. So I did try and do this when I first came in here, not knowing that we needed the lunar heart yet. Like, I don't know, we'll just kind of put people randomly. I don't really know how it works. Uh, put, a, put a whole bunch of, bunch of people. Hang. Okay. Can be detonated underground by pressing square. Each staff member will calculate the tremors and look in the direction of the buried item. In other words, the excavation area is where the staff member's line of sight intersects. Where it intersects? Dang. Yep. Okay. Any, uh, any, just give me a lunar heart, please. Blue heart, lunar heart, let's go, okay. So now, the additional question is, where's the sleeping forest? Here? Okay. Girl in pink and a man in black entered earlier, though. Do you think they're all right? Yeah, um... I mean, Sephiroth could maybe hold his own. Aerith, um, someone can sneeze on her and she'd die. I do want to say before we go too deep into this uh, area. See, I was thinking the forest was maybe that other dot on this northern continent. So, let's uh, go see if we can go after Aerith. We have yet to actually get into any combat with uh, the Yuffie Eufsters. Since, thankfully, mercifully, you can't get into combat when you're on the Tiny Bronco. Is a uh, big fan of that. Now, I also think Yuffie might be kind of bad, but the sleeping—I don't know what her uh, limit break is. Uh, it's the sleeping forest awoke. Ujata materia. Not familiar with that one, if I'm being honest. Summons Kujata. Don't know who, uh... Oh, that's a, that's a new summon, I believe. I don't think that's been in any previous games. Water Ring? I could be swayed to equip a Water Ring. I'm just guessing that, uh... If you're giving it to us, it must uh, have a reason. Now, Yuffie can at least sit in the back line, which is something, and do damage. So, how much damage do you do, girly? I'm not expecting, like, a ton, but I want at least a decent amount. Batty, you have to have a good limit break. Oh, they're dancing. You guys thought about, I don't know, doing damage? That's not half bad. For being back row damage? Not half bad at all. Now, will you stay past the probationary period? Probably not, but, uh... I don't know what I'm looking at. I, I, I have no functional clue what I'm looking at right now. Like, I don't know where to go. Can we go up the... Oh, we can walk up this. Nah. I refuse. You, you better let me run. Just let me use an ability. Okay, fine. Be that way. I gave you an out. You rejected it. Now you must die. 
You pay for your hubris and blood? Do -do -do. You know, like Yuffie's little shuriken dance she does. Anything over here? No, we just made this section as a joke. Not much of a forest, you know? I mean, there was like some trees, but they have all quickly been vacated. What in the hell are you? Sir, explain yourself to me. Why do you look so wonky? Does minimum persist? Oh, dude, she's like so tiny. Oh, does minimum wear off after combat? I feel like most status effects wear off unless you're anger or sadness. I don't... I'm moving? I think I'm moving. Oh, wait, can I save back here? Is that a curiosity? I mean, we are on the overworld. Yeah. Yuffie, you seem decent enough. You can stay in the party. Just to say that we used you for at least a little bit. I haven't even... I would like to at least see what your limit breaks are before we, uh, ditch you forever. Long walk up to Mushroom Land. Oh, they kind of look mushrooms. I guess they're more like coral? Something? I don't know. What you would call these things. I don't know what I'm looking at. Uh, Mr. Fish, is this your home? Do you live here? May I, may I talk to the magic fish? We, I think we're going up? We got a meteorite media. Materia. Anybody want to learn meteorite? Uh, did I miss it? Gives Comet and Cometor. Okay. Where am I supposed to go? Like, was there another exit in here? And that seemed like a complete dead end. And we got... Meteorite. Can't talk to the fish. I don't see any other red arrows. Maybe if we loop around this way or something? Can't. The game's kind of guilty of doing that, where you're just like, I don't know what you want from me. I mean, this feels like a pretty important spot, and there's just, like, nothing here but a materia? You know, it feels like something should. I don't really... Also, it's like, takes forever. Maybe if we go to the left or right here? Ah, okay. And there's a... Nope. I mean, let's, uh... No. I'm gonna keep it on two times speed. Ugh! Are these the words of the ancients? It's no good, I can't understand. Just because there's so much running? A forgotten city. I see why people forgot about it. Magic source? Anything else in here? Not again, it's flowing directly in my mind. Are these the words of the ancients? 
You didn't take ancient uh, language as an elective cloud? What the hell, dude? Aurora bracelet? It absorbs ice damage. Pretty good. No, don't, don't equip that, please. Yeah. Uh, or take Titan. Why not? Now I'm just go in the arrow. Go in the arrow. Or not. I have to go all the way back on the right side. Thankfully, there's no random battles here, but... It is a lot of walking. Guard source? Maybe we should use that. I wouldn't mind making Cloud more beefy, especially since we're doing the protect strats to try and get him to... Be able to ult as often as possible? Wait, what is Cosmo Memory? Teaches the ultimate limit skill Cosmo Memory. I mean, it's probably for Nanaki. What is this crap? Ultimate limit skill Cosmo Memory. I mean, I would assume that's for uh, Nanaki, but... Also, that reminds me, didn't you say you learned a limit break Nanaki and then it you never actually learned it? So, like, you, you devised Howling Moon and then we've never been able to use that? You like to explain yourself? Elixir? will never be used, will still be sitting in my inventory at the end of the game, because, uh, what if we need them? Rest spot? Look, they're beds. Come on, let's take a break, I'm sick of walking. Guess we should probably end things here soon. Yeah, I think we will go ahead and cut things off here. And I'm going to go back and, like, I can feel it. What's wrong? Are you, are you, aren't you feeling well? Uh, my mind is like mush after Sephiroth fucked it. Oh, it's Sephiroth. What, Sephiroth's here too? How? How can you know that? Uh, I'm not making it up. I can feel it deep down inside me. What are we going to do? We have to hurry, something awful will happen. Yeah, let's go find her. Well, I'm trying to think if I want to end the recording for the day. I do kind of want to finish this section. We have to find Aerith, so we can't go this way. That's where we're supposed to... Okay, this takes us on the other side of this, but like, I still don't know where to go. Like... Uh, jump off? Interact with anything? I don't know what I'm looking at. I mean, I assume this isn't just a dead end, right? Right? Where do I go? What do I do? Um... I guess we'll stop here in the next video. We'll try and figure out what the hell we're supposed to do. I'm Extra Cheesy 87. Stay tuned for the next part. And bye, guys.